What's up everybody, welcome to another Dokkan battle video. Uh, this video we're going to be looking at the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks event. Mainly the 50 stamina super hard event. If you've been watching my stream recently, you know that this sucker has been kicking my butt lately, so... I'm going to show a method that I've been using lately to beat him. Uh, I haven't been doing it on stream, and it actually was a suggestion from one of my viewers on the stream, which was... Use double Gogeta lead and have a bunch of stunners, which is pretty much what I've done. I know a lot of people have been saying use double Super Vegito or some mono teams or stuff like that, but that doesn't work out for me. So this turned out to be the method that actually has been doing pretty well. So I'm going to go ahead and show it and go from there. So as you can see, it's a super difficulty. 50 stamina, uh, which I believe is going to be the norm now for newer Dokkan events. There's three forms that you have to fight. The first one is Goten and Kid Trunks. Second form is Super Saiyan Gotenks. And then the last form is Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, but he transforms. And there's two forms he can transform to. There's the regular STR Super Saiyan Gotenks, which is the other TUR card in this event. And also uh, base form Gotenks, the STR version. The difference between Super Saiyan 3 versus the other two is he has increased defense or damage reduction against every unit that's not Piccolo or Super Buu. Uh, Super Saiyan form has normal defense, so you can do regular damage to him. And then base form has uh, even less defense, so you can do additional damage to him. So anyway, as you can see, it's usually easier for most people to find a Gogeta lead, which is why I think this strategy might be more viable. And let's pick out my items here. So we're going with two heals as norm. I'm going to use ghosts and Baba standard package defense so my team like I said I have double Gogeta lead I'm using AGL Golden Frieza as my main blocker I have three stunners that I'm using for this fight General Blue which is one of the best stunners in the game AGL Whis who not only stuns with the super but has a passive that heals and Cyborg Tao. This is the Super Strike version and he's maxed out. So the reason I have him is because he only needs 8 to 9 key to activate his Super, which has a chance to stun. So he's a low cost stunner for me. Especially with the plus 6 key that I'm getting from my leader types. And I'm using the free tech Super Boo from the event, uh, from the Kid Boo event. So he's going to be my actual super hard hitter. So anyway, let's go ahead and go into the fight. Since I'm not taking any key items, uh, I have to take the path to the right, which has all the key spots, and hope I get lucky and get key to the right people. That being my stunners and super boo, like that right there, that was perfect. Holy crap. Okay, one stunner. Gogeta's fine. I'm gonna need to actually hit with Gogeta. Tao, that's nice. Not so much for him. He's not gonna be hitting very much. Okay, so Boo's definitely getting a super. Okay, so both Gogeta's got a little bit, that's nice. So all three of my hitters got a little bit. The only one that didn't get anything was Blue, General Blue, which kind of sucks because he's my best stunner. So it's going to take a little bit of work to get him his super. But it's nice to know that my hardest hitter has an automatic super no matter what. Alright, so what we're going to do here is, yeah, just attack him. Tao, 
cow is locked and loaded. Hopefully he can stun him off the bat, that'd be nice. suck taking the hit right away. I'm going to see if I get lucky and if I can stun him off the bat. Because I'd like to avoid having to heal right now. Okay, so the stun did work. Wow, RNG. I have to use a heal here. But it doesn't look like I have a choice. That should take out trunks. I could have survived that, but better safe than sorry. I wonder if that re-stunned him. Did that re-dizzy him? It did. Alright, so we're done with the first round. Unfortunately, I did have to use a heal. I was really hoping not to have to use a heal. didn't work out at all. Be nice if he stuns him. It didn't. And he supers me right back. Wow. Really? What a piece of shit. And I can't get another super? Wow.
Should have healed before this. So frustrating. Shouldn't have had to use two heals already. Hopefully that re-dizzied. Yeah. And yeah, now he's definitely done. I could try to slow play it. But nah. Because it would be nice to start with Super Boo, but... It's fine. Let's get out of here. Okay, so final form. <sighs> can I get a six? I think I can get six out of this. What I need to do... Move that down. Perfect. can't get his super, but that's not as important. Yeah, that's fine. Right off the bat super! Awesome! Freaking awesome. Do your job. Do your job, Blue. You were put on t this team for moments like this. That's right. Okay, so now I can just slow play this and do whatever I want here. We're going to try to restun him. Even though he's probably going to transform. But that's fine. That's fine. Who cares? Go ahead and transform. You're still going to eat this damage. I probably should have healed. Oh well. Here's the damage. That's why you have Boo on the team. So we escaped Stun Nation. I feel like I can probably get away with just saying no supers. I need to figure out how to get six. Hmm. It's a good riddle. I don't think there's any way for me to do that. Purple fall there. I'd have to sacrifice something. Let's just do this. 
Oh, short one. Okay, so we're not going to stun. So that's why I was really hoping General Blue was one of the ones that would have gotten some key. Look at that, plan that just right. And then Whis, perfect. That was perfect. Alright, so we're gonna try and stun the crap out of him. That's one, that's two, then Gogeta. Not that it really matters, because he's probably gonna go away after this turn. And he didn't stun. Neither one of them did. That's fine. It wasn't too much damage at least. Back to three. But I have my blockers up. And my stunner. Alright, so we actually got some purples going here. That's good. I want you to stun him. Stun him! There you go. There you go. Now the question is, can I re-stun? Even though he's probably going to go away. four out of it, can I? Or can I? Even though it's not going to matter, he's not going to do any damage. Well, 50k. At least get him down to the third life bar.
I able to restun? Oh, he's transforming. Oh, here we go. Base form. I'm going to take a risk on this. I'm banking that I can stun him. But even though I'm banking on that, I'm still going to heal. We get two really big hits on him too. Did that stun? I didn't stun him. Wow. The one time he doesn't stun. Well, either way, we got him down to the last life bar. At least I have one more heal. It's a good thing I healed. Although, actually, I could just ghost. Gogeta might be able to finish him off. Maybe not. He's stunned anyway. Is he going to transform here, though? Yep. Transform back. Okay, so here we're going to say no super... He's going to attack me first, of course. But it doesn't matter, because I'm going to hit him with Boo and kill him. Even getting a Dokkan. And there you go. And that is how I beat him. Would have been better if General Blue had gotten the key instead of the other guys, since he's my main stunner, even though he did fail to stun one time. But for the most part, like I'm pretty successful with the stuns. As long as the RNG doesn't totally screw you over, like giving him first attack like every time I think it's pretty viable because uh, most people have stun characters nowadays and having double Gogeta lead obviously the biggest plus is you're getting plus six key to everybody to start uh, another character I could have used with Tao was probably uh, Jackie Chun since they have an additional link between them but anyhow that's it for this video. Uh, I'll show you my Goten that I Dokkan Awaken to Gotenks right here. And that's pretty much how I did it because I do not have Super Vegito and I know there's quite a few people that do not. So maybe this is an alternative for you. Uh, instead of Gogeta, you could possibly use, like, uh, Turles, who's a conditional plus three, but he's also a stunner. Uh, Demigra's another plus three, who I believe stuns also. Uh, so there's options out there. I know some people were talking about using characters that seal supers. Seal, sealing supers is good, but that's most effective if you're using a Super Vegito team. Since I'm not, uh, I f stuns made more sense for me but anyway hopefully this video helps some of you guys out if you're having trouble with the event if you have any questions or comments feel free to do so below and we'll see you next time